Thank you. It is a pleasure to be here. And thank you for the lovely introduction. My talk is about longevity entrepreneur assets. And I'm also going to take a look at targeting mistaken assumptions about the longevity industry. In my opening statement, I'll claim that the longevity industry is indeed a complex system that requires a thorough assessment of innovation, available resources, and financing. The industry consists of different sectors, geoscience, the science of aging, biomedicine, personalized and preventative medicine, as well as age tech and digital IT interventions for protocols. The true goal of longevity is realistic and practical. It's an approach to maximize healthy lifespan and life expectancy through biomedical intervention, education, addressing the pros and cons, of course, and the consequences of social change. My talk today concerns longevity entrepreneurs, their assets and mistaken assumptions about the longevity industry. So why do we need entrepreneurs? Why are entrepreneurs necessary for innovation, for advancing, for growth, for human potential? And why are some of the ideas that entrepreneurs bring forth within the industry of longevity or anti-aging misunderstood or misconstrued? Let's take a look. <laughs> 